hi everyone so in this video i'm going to start a new unit uh, in the subject statistics and numerical methods so now we are going to enter unit number 5 uh, numerical solutions of ordinary differential equations under the unit we are having the following topics or like taylor series method euler's method modified Euler's method and fourth order Renjikuta method simply we call it as RK method Adam Bashforth predictor and corrector method so out of this RK method is very very important as well as it is, it is uh, more powerful than um, other methods so now uh, we are going to classify single and multi-step methods single step method is nothing but it requires only one numerical value for finding um, y but multi-step method while you are finding the uh, final y value we need at least four of the past which means uh, previous y values why we are calculating y value at final y value we need at least four uh, past values so single step methods are taylor series euler's and rk methods these are all called the single step methods in this particular methods we need only one y value previous y value for finding uh, y yi but adams bashford predictor corrector formula is multi step method here uh, while you are finding the final y value we need at least uh, four previous y values that's why we call it this as multi step method so now in this video i am going to discuss about taylor series method so before that uh, what is a differential equation generally uh, we call it as dy by dx is equal to some function function of x so which is called as a differential equation how can you could solve this differential equation either you just move this dx into right hand side and take a integral on both the sides you will get y value you no know? this is one simple way for solving a differential equation so also uh, like another example uh, dy by dx is equal to x plus y like the previous case i'm just moving this dx into right hand side after integrating this both sides i'll get y value so these are all these simple method basic method for solving one differential equation okay in this particular unit we are going to use different methods for solving the differential equations as well as we are going to find out the numerical value of the given differential equation So at very first method uh, for solving the differential method I'm going to choose is Taylor series method. So procedure for finding uh, y value is the given dy by dx is equal to y dash. Y dash is nothing but f of x comma y. So y dash is we can rewrite this y dash is as also uh, f of x comma y. Y dash dy by dx simplest form is y dash right. Okay. So with the initial condition y of x naught is equal to y naught. Uh, while we are going to the second derivative, d square y by dx square is equal to. Uh, this is nothing but f of x comma y. No, while I'm doing f with respect to x, uh, here I'm doing uh, differentiation. Uh, do f by do x into dx by dx. No, that's no need to men mention here because dx by dx value is one plus do f by do y into dy by dx this is d square y by dx square value so this simplest form is y double dash so do f by do x means uh, f with respect to x derivative value so this is f with respect to y derivative value and dy by dx is equal to y dash we already took that um, in the previous step okay similarly we can able to find out y triple dash y power fourth order derivative etc
Look at the Taylor series expansion formula. Taylor series expansion of y of x above the curve y is equal to x naught is given by y of x is equal to y of x naught plus x minus x naught by 1 factorial into y dash of x naught plus x minus x naught the whole square by 2 factorial into y double dash of x naught plus x minus x naught power 3 by 3 3 factorial into y triple dash of x naught plus etc otherwise we can replace in place of x minus x naught into h h is nothing but x minus x naught so after replacing it i will get y of uh, if y of x1 so this is uh, uh, in this way only we are going to use for while you are doing the problem so for finding y1 value uh, we need to use the previous y value that's why i kept it here y not uh, here i'm taking y of a, y, y of x not as y not y of x not is equivalent to y not look at the previous case in the previous slide we have uh, we have seen one equation oh, y of uh, x0 is equal to y0 that is an initial condition in place of y of x0 I am uh, using y0 here so after uh, using that I will get y0 y0 dash y0 double dash etc like that after that I am going to use in place of x minus x0 into h right okay so after simply after simple uh, substituting these things uh, I will get the simplest form as like y of x1 is equal to y1 which is equal to y0 plus h by 1 factorial y0 dash plus h square by 2 factorial y0 double dash plus etc when we are finding y1 value we need to use the previous y value that is y0 when you go for the y2 we need to use this y1 in the place of y in the formula right so in this way we uh, continue the process for finding the consecutive y values so look at the first problem under this category using taylor series method find y of 1.1 given that y dash is equal to x plus y y dash means what dy by dx dy by dx they are given x plus y also they are given the initial condition y of 1 is equal to 0 y of 1 is equal to 0 means what so this is nothing but y of x naught is equal to y naught right so therefore i want to take uh, this one as x naught x naught is equal to 1 and this 0 is uh, y naught because you just compare this into the general form you will get x0 and y0 value whatever we need to find that you have to take as x1 suppose they may give another um, value they are asking to find out one more value means you will take that as x2 okay so this one as x1 in the initial condition i will take this as x0 and this as y0 and given derivative is here now how will you calculate h value h is equal to x1 minus x0 x1 is what we want we need to find out y at 1.1 no so this uh, as x1 value minus x0 is 1 so therefore i will get h is equal to 0 0.1 what is our taylor series formula for finding y1 here i need to find out only one y value right so therefore we develop uh, Taylor series formula for y1 so y1 is equal to y0 plus h by 1 factorial y0 dash plus h square by 2 factorial y0 double dash plus etc we are replacing uh, y0 y0 dash y0 double dash y0 triple dash values these and all so for that i'm going to find out in the so next slide so how will you find out the y not dash y not, y not double dash y not triple dash values so given y dash is equal to x plus y direct away uh, i'm going to replace in place of x y into x not y not uh, then only i can able to find out y not dash right after replacing it i will get y not dash is equal to x not plus y not x not y not we know very well in the given problem itself uh, 1 plus 0 after replacing it i will get y naught dash value is one so next is second derivative just to differentiate this with respect to x while i'm doing that i will get x become one 
and y become dy by dx that is y dash so therefore uh, like the previous step i am replacing in place of x y into x naught y naught i will get y naught double dash is equal to 1 plus y naught dash now y naught dash i am having in the previous step itself that value is 1 so after replacing y naught dash value i will get 1 plus 1 is equal to 2 now i move on to the third derivative here 1 becomes 0 y naught become y double dash so y naught Triple, triple dash is equal to y naught double dash so y naught double dash value is 2 now the fourth derivative is y double dash become y triple dash so after replacing y into y naught i will get y naught power fourth order is equal to y naught triple dash which is equal to this value is 2 like away i am going to find out these derivative values they would have mentioned up to um up to the third degree up to the fourth degree means we need to trim the formula accordingly okay here they won't mention anything so therefore you can develop the formula up to third degree it, it is must okay so now y1 is equal to y naught y1 is equal to y naught y naught value is zero plus h h value in the previously i would have find h is equal to 0 0.1 that is what is the formula for h x1 minus x naught x1 is 1.1 and x is x is uh, x naught is equal to 1 1.1 1 .1 minus 1 is 0 0.1 by 1 factorial into uh, y naught dash that is equal to 1 plus h square by 2 factorial into y naught double dash plus h is cube by 3 factorial into y naught triple dash plus h power 4 by 4 factorial into y power 4 derivative value so after simplifying all those things i will get the final value of y of 1.1 is equal to 0 0.11031 so this is nothing but y of x1 is equal to y1 so next uh, i'm having the next problem under the taylor seri series category find y at x is equal to 0 0.1 if dy by dx is equal to x square y minus 1 as well as they are given y of x y of 0 equal to 1 we need to consider this 0 as x naught and this one as y naught and we must take this as x1 we need to find out y value at this particular point which means what y1 we need to find given y dash is equal to this particular one and x naught is equal to 0 y naught is equal to 1 how will you calculate h h is equal to uh, x1 minus x naught x1 is equal to 0 0.1 minus x naught equal to 0 it remains 0 0.1 so we are having the taylor series formula for y1 is equal to like this y1 means how will you for how will you develop the formula y1 is equal to y naught plus h by 1 factorial y naught dash plus h square by 2 factorial y naught double dash plus etc uh, for finding y1 we need to use y place is equal to in the right answer y naught suppose we need to find out one more x value x is equal to 0 0.1 comma 0 0.2 means that 0 0.2 you have to take x2 for finding x2 uh, we go for y2 y2 is equal to y1 h by 1 factor into y1 dash like that we need to develop the formula yeah now i'm going to find out this y naught y naught dash y naught double dash values so look at here so y naught is equal y dash is equal to given a derivative uh, I, direct away i am replacing this particular one into uh, x y is equal to x naught y naught after replacing it i am now very well x naught y one y naught value in the given problem itself that is 0 1 after replacing it i will get y naught dash is equal to minus 1 so next i am going to find out the second derivative from this y dash uh, y double dash is equal to here i'm having x square y no we need to apply the uv formula i'm just keeping this uh, y differentiate x square i will get 2x plus i'm just keeping this x square and differentiating y i will get dy by dx minus 1 become 0 so in this case i will replace x y into x naught y naught I will get y naught double dash is equal to 2 times of x naught y naught plus x naught square into y naught dash which is equal to 
um, x naught y naught value we already know very well 0 and 1 it becomes 0 x naught dash x naught value 0 x naught square so this is also 0 totally I will get y naught double dash value is 0 now let us move on to the third derivative so here in the first term itself I am having 2 x y so 2 as a constant apply u v for this x y product rule for this x y you just keep this x and differentiate this y I will get y dash plus next you just keep this y and differentiate x that become 1 okay I will get y alone plus here also I am having two terms you just keep this x square and differentiate this y dash that become y double dash plus y dash just keep y dash plus uh, uh, differentiate this x square that become 2x now I am replacing x y into x naught y naught throughout this particular one I will get y naught triple dash is equal to 2 into x naught y naught dash plus y naught plus x naught square into y naught double dash plus y naught dash into 2 into x naught after replacing these values I will get y naught triple dash value is 2 like away I move on to the fourth derivative here uh, two constant differentiate x into uh, y dash you just keep this y dash differentiate x it become 1 I will get 2 into y dash plus I just keep this x differentiate y dash you will get y double dash like here y become y dash here also I need to apply the uh, product rule I just keep this y dash y double dash and differentiate this x square that become 2x plus x square into y double dash become y triple dash this is wrongly entered y double dash this is y triple dash actually plus so I just keep this 2x uh, and differentiate this y dash this that become y double dash plus uh, 2 into y dash into 1x become 1 okay in this particular thing also I am replacing in place of x y into x naught y naught after replacing and substituting the corresponding values I will get x y naught power 4 derivative value is minus 6 now I am going to use these values into the Taylor series formula y1 is equal to y naught y naught value is what 1 plus h h value 0 0.1 by 1 factorial into y naught dash value plus h square by 2 factorial into y naught double dash value plus h cube by 3 factorial into y naught triple dash value plus h power 4 by 4 factorial into y naught power 4th derivative value here it is 2 not 0 yeah so 2 by 6 3 factorial value 6 2 by 6 is 3 so 2 factorial value is 2 uh, 1 minus yeah this becomes 0 because anything into 0 is 0 1 minus of 0 0.1 here 0 0.1 power 3 by yeah 2 by 6 is 3 minus of uh, 4 factorial values 24 6 by 24 is 4 so therefore 0.41 power 4 by 24 throughout the simplification gives y of 0 0.1 is equal to 0 0.900308 so this is our final answer Thank you everyone.